friends, I hope you're doing well today. We're gonna play a fun game of Hearthstone. If you haven't played Hearthstone before, it's a really fun card game made by Activision Blizzard. I'm going to be playing the Battleground format because it's my favorite. And I hope that we get some good cards and matchups today. The game is running a little bit laggy for some reason, so I apologize if that happens. It's the only game on my computer that's doing so. So we have Ragnaros the Fire Lord. After you kill 25 enemy minions, get Sulfurus. Or Avatar of Nazoth. Start the game with a 2 2 fish that gains all your death rattles in combat. I'm gonna go with Ragnaros. Because I don't know if I'll be playing a death rattle um, deck. So for battlegrounds, you get a shop that you get to purchase from. It's kind of similar to TFT, to be honest with you. Um, so if you like that, you'll probably like this. Looks like there's only four of us, which is weird. It's usually eight people. Okay, so we have three coins to buy. After you summon a Murloc, gain plus one attack. Oh, let's... So let's do this, and then let's... And then let's freeze it, because next time we'll grab this guy, so when we summon him, he'll get plus one attack, plus we can give a friendly murloc plus one plus one when he enters the battlefield. So to take a card is three gold, unless there's something different on the field. But we're gonna lose this because he populates cats, so... Since these are one star creatures, it'll go 1 1 plus his damage, and that's gonna attack us. Take this guy now. We'll give plus 1 plus 1, and he'll get plus 1 plus 1, or plus 1 attack. So now we have plus 4, 4 attack, 6 health, and 4 attack, 5 health. And I'm going to refresh just to see, and I'm gonna freeze that too because I want. So it looks like we're going to be playing some Murlocs today. Murlocs. 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 I'm not a huge fan of Murlocs in real life. But in Hearthstone it's okay. Oh, we're fighting someone who didn't do anything. It's very strange. Okay. We'll grab this one. And we'll give this to this guy. And that's... We can refresh. We can get another one. So, same thing as TFT. If you grab a third, it'll make like a, a rank up of the champion. So, we want to do that. day wherever you are and it's a nice fall weather outside we are getting pretty cold where I live but I still like it I like the cold but I don't like the extremely cold but I love wearing cozy sweaters Okay, so we won that one. We're gonna attack for two damage to his hero. And then we're gonna take our 
third murloc of this kind is gonna turn into a gold card or a silver card. We'll get this one plus two plus two, and because we leveled up, we get a free discover a minion from tier two. Um, we'll do the tad, and when we sell him, we'll get a random murloc. We got another one of these. Okay, we'll just do that. And then we're gonna upgrade our tavern to tier 2 because we'll get tier 2 minions. Give to every Merlots. Yeah, I want that one. We're gonna save that. So, as you can see, there's a lot of synergy between the cards. So, for example, even though I got that Merloc and sold it immediately, when I brought him onto the battlefield, it gave attack to the one murloc, and then when I sold him, I got another murloc. And when I put that one out, it also gave attack and health to the other murloc. So it's kind of like, it's like a strategy card game, but it's also really easy to learn. I found it easier to learn than, say, TFT. I don't play any other card games, really. Um, I do play magic sometimes, um, but I don't play Pokemon, but I collect Pokemon cards, so I'm one of those people. <laughs> okay, let's do a refresh and see what we get. If you have any unspent gold at the end of your turn, get two blood gems. When you sell this, get a 2-2 elemental. When you sell this, get two blood gems. Choose a minion, add a minion of its type to the tavern. Okay, well, I will just pick a murloc then. Whenever this kills a minion, give a minion in your hand plus two plus two. Okay, we'll hold on to that. I don't know if you're supposed to freeze this much. Um, I know that there are different strategies for sure for this game. I just play for fun. I am not an expert or anything like that. I just think it's a fun, relaxing game. Unfortunately, the in-game sounds and the music were way too lively for ASMR, so I had to turn it off. I might put some overlay over the good here. I do really like this portrait of the murloc with the pitchfork and the cleaver. He's like a chef. An angry chef. Okay, we'll do this. Put him out. We want another murloc, so we'll do that. We get another one. I think we're out of them now. We'll just get rid of that and do that. And we'll refresh to see what we get. Another rock pool hunter. We'll freeze. And buy him next turn. I think this is going okay so far. Not too bad. It's so weird though that there's only four people. It might be a quick game because of that, but I hope it's still relaxing nonetheless. I love that Hearthstone uses World of Warcraft characters. World of Warcraft is my favorite game of all time. I play it a lot and I've been playing it for 15 plus years. Um, my other game that I would say rivals that is Pokemon. Um, again, I've played Pokemon since I was a kid, and I really love it, so I'm hoping to get more Pokemon content on the channel. I just got a capture card so that I could play with my Switch, or I could play with, I don't know, something else, but I, I haven't used it before, so I have to figure
but I was thinking of doing a Pokemon Nuzlocke. I thought that could be really fun. I hope you guys like that idea. sure how we are doing right now. Looks like we got Sulfurus though, so at the end of your turn, give to your left your left and right most minions plus three plus three. That's very good. So in this scenario it should give both of these plus three plus three. We'll see. We'll see. Keep an eye out on them or it'll give these two. But if we wanted to do our left and right most minions, we'd probably do this one. And yeah, we can leave this one. Let's upgrade. And give a random minion in your hand plus five plus five. Is that forever? Because that's good. You know what? Let's get rid of oh. Give one plus one plus one. Let's get rid of these, because they're not that great right now. We'll take this. And when this dies, it's going to give a random minion in my hand plus five plus five. So we're going to put it like near the front so it dies sooner than the later ones. And they'll get beefed up. This is also a murloc. After you play a battle cry minion game plus one plus one. Mm, I'm not super interested. like this guy's out already. I wonder if he just... Oh no, he definitely got beat. He got minus 10, minus 9. Minus 10, minus 9. Minus 5, minus 9. Hmm. Okay. So this guy is doing beasts. And beasts are really strong, in my opinion, because they can populate, and then you have a lot of cards like these that give beasts, like, plus two, plus two. So when they, when you get a new one, it gets plus two, plus two, and then that gets plus two. It's just, like, never-ending. But we still, we still won. We were just playing someone who's not even in the game. It's just, like, a random... PC, I think. Okay, so elemental. Give your slimy shields that gain one one taunt when you sell this to your one minion. Give a good deal taunt. Okay, I don't want those. When you refresh, gain plus one health. This has all minion types. This might be good because then I can use it as a murloc. Probably sell it though if I get something better. Yeah, let's see. Oh, we can do this again. Get rid of this one and do it again. And beat them all up. Nice. And. Okay. That's all we're gonna do for this turn. It looks like there's an arena part right now that says at the start of your turn, give minions in the tavern plus one plus one for the rest of the game. So that's why they're also like beefy. <laughs> usually these are really like plus. Yeah, this is usually a two four. This is a three one, a two four, and a three one. So normally they're not this strong. doing beasts and pirates. Hmm. With crabs. <laughs> Gain a 6-4 crab until your next turn. Gain couplings. Gain a pirate. Summon a 1-1 one, one pirate. Oh my goodness. It's 
see, it's just like so many creatures that just keep popping up. Luckily, they're like pretty low health, so we don't have to worry too much, but still kind of scary. I could see that being a big problem if he gets the right cards. You saw this, get a random murloc. Okay. So again, we'll beef them up. Then we'll sell it to get a random murloc. Get another one of these guys. We'll do that. This is not very good though. Let's get rid of him and take the higher uh, higher HP and and attack so that at least it's something. So you can see the rarity of the card is at the top, so four stars, one star, four star, four star, and we're a four star um, tavern right now, so that's why we're seeing higher level cards. But these cards are all level one, three, one, two, 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 two. And so if they're, al if they're alive at the end of our turn, how much damage they'll add to the to our attack based on the rarity. I hope that makes sense. It's just the two of us left now, so we'll probably just be fighting each other until one of us runs out of health. So, strap in. <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. This is gonna summon a crab, which might kill us. It did, but it was a tie. Okay. We gotta figure this out then. Let's take this. Take this, this will level this up. We'll put that out. Tie a tier 5 minion. At the end of your turn, gain plus 2 plus 2 for each minion type you control. That's not good because we just have murlocs. Your death rattle triggers an extra time. Summon two mech horses with death rattle, summon a mech pony. Yeah, this has extra death rattle, so that'll instigate this. Give your other murlocs two health. We'll freeze him. We'll freeze him for after. Hopefully this works out. Um, I mean the pony is not like super ideal to keep, but it gives us some like respawning beasts, which is not a bad either, but once I get a better card to replace it, I probably will. Mechanized gift horse. Mechanized gift horse. He's looking extra beefy now. Mercury. He's definitely got some, he definitely leveled up some of these guys a lot. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> I'm unsure if we win this, guys. I don't think we do. Which is okay.
Okay, we weren't beaten too bad. We only took six damage. So that's just gonna break our shield. So we still have 30 health. Okay, we'll take him. And him. We're gonna get rid of this. Do this. And be nice if we could get One more warlock, but no, that's okay. I don't think that the plus five plus five stays. I'm just taking a look. I don't see it on anybody. But we've done. These two are getting the hand of Sulfurus, so maybe I'll move these out so these ones can start getting buffed. The only thing about Hearthstone is like, you have to wait for so long. I feel like if we're both, you must be really thinking about He's only on tier 3 of his tavern. We're on tier 4. This is the end of my turn. Okay. Oh, it does end at the end. Okay, I see. So they've both got plus 3, plus 3 now. Okay, so we, so he's doing death rattles, so every time something dies, more stuff pops up, which is very scary. Whenever this kills, give a minion in your hand. Oh, oops. I didn't figure that out. Okay, so we want stuff in our hand, so we can get it buffed up. Oh my goodness. See, I'm not I'm definitely no expert player, that's for sure. Do. Let's see what we get. Get a random elemental at the start of your turn, gain one gold, repeat for each other friendly pirate. Destroy the minion that killed this. Okay. We'll just for him to get buffed by Mercules, and then we can put him out too. Maybe replace it for like something with Battle Cry, because Battle Cry only happens when it goes on the field. So these guys are just stat sticks, basically. I really like this card, Rip Snarl Captain. So whenever a friendly pirate attacks, give it plus three attack. It's pretty good.
we won that one. That's exciting. Okay. That's very good. And now he's 3228. And we hit him for 10 damage. Oh my goodness, that's good. Okay. This one's good, so while this is in your hand after you play a Murloc, game plus three plus three. I'm not sure what to do. Honestly, I just think I'm gonna keep it like this for now. We'll see what he comes back with after his loss last time. He might change things up. This match was definitely longer than I thought it was going to be, considering there was only four of us, and there was only two of us, like, rather late in the game. It is a battleground, though, so I will get rating, which is nice. I think I'm at, like, 2,500 right now, which is not great, but I haven't really been playing. So hopefully, I can get a little bit of rating out of this game. I know I could level up my tavern, but I'm just, I don't really need to right now, I don't think. Ooh, that's a strong, strong boy. Okay. Don't know why the one guy was so strong, the rest of them have been fine. like we win this one too. And we're gonna hit for 14. We win. That's awesome. Hmm. Got 104 rating for that, so that's great. Well, thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. I hope you found this relaxing and kind of fun. Um, if you'd like to see more Hearthstone videos, let me know. But until next time, I hope you have a great day.